Hello, and welcome to iTalk Cloud Solutions. My name is Jay, just one of the many iTalk team members ready to serve you. In this video, we will get more familiar with your iTalk desktop endpoint, specifically features, functionality, and applications. In today's example, we will be using the Yealink T29G model, which is very similar to the T27 model in functionality. The T29 has a full color 4.5 inch LCD screen, a gigabit Ethernet port on the bottom, and Optima HD voice quality. Your T29 endpoint has three layers to the color screen enabling functionality on 27 individual DSS keys. These are the DSS keys here on the side. Using the bottom right button, you can scroll through three pages of programmed DSS keys. These DSS keys are typically used for park buttons, intercom buttons, speed dial buttons, and line keys. The buttons below the color screen are called soft keys. These buttons will change functionality depending on the particular action being performed during a call. Simply pressing the menu button will take you to the main menu page where you can customize your phone in many different ways. Your icons include status where you can check your IP address and MAC address, features where you can call forward your phone to any extension or outside number, directory where you can start building your company and personal phone book, history where you can scroll through all incoming and outgoing calls. Message, where you can check all voicemail messages, including any extension that you're authorized to check. Basic, where you can change the language on your phone, time and date, display, ringtones, pen numbers, and activate Bluetooth. You can customize your wallpaper by uploading your own JPEG file. You can change your ring sounds. Now that you are a little more familiar with your T29 endpoint, let's go over some basic call handling features and applications. In this demonstration, I will first tell you how to perform a particular action, then I will demonstrate the action on the endpoint itself. To make an outside call, pick up the handset or press the speaker button or simply start dialing, then press send. Okay. 
to make intercom calls. Dial the extension number and press send or simply press the DSS key. To place a call on hold, press the hold key or the park set key. Please note the difference between putting a call on hold and putting a call on park is that when you put a caller on hold, the call is only on hold on your phone. When you park set a caller, the caller is parked or held on everyone's phone so anyone can retrieve the caller by pressing the lit park button. Thank you for calling the time of... When you want to resume the call, just press resume. 8, 49 p.m. To park, Where the current press park set. 80. To retrieve a held call, press the resume key if the call is on hold or press the park key if the call is parked. To transfer a call to another extension, while on a call, press the transfer key, then dial an extension or DSS key. After you announce the caller information, press the transfer key again. Thank you for calling the time and weather brought. To transfer a caller directly to voicemail, press transfer, then star, then the extension number or DSS key, and then press transfer again. Thank you for calling the time and weather brought to you by the... To receive a second caller during a call. If your phone rings when you are talking to another caller and you wish to talk between both parties, simply press the answer soft key, which will appear on the bottom of the display screen and the first call will automatically be put on hold. You can then navigate between the calls using the soft keys. I will demonstrate by calling out first and then dialing in. Thank you for calling the time and weather brought to you by the Metropolitan now I will dial in. Government and Clean Air Partners. The current time is 2.41. You see incoming call. Where the current temperature is. Answer. 89. The first call is put on hold. And now you are talking to the second caller. You can swap between the two calls. Council of Governments Air Quality Forecast for You can end the second call or the first call. Resume the first call. Washington, D.C. and vicinity. For the call forwarding. To forward your extension to another extension or to an outside number, select the menu key, then select features then select call forward and then select the forwarding option you prefer. Use the keypad to enter the dial information and press the save button. Enable
can now make it enabled or disabled. I will disable it for now. To check voice messages, press the message button and enter your password. You can then check new messages and change voicemail options. Please refer to your iTalk representative for your endpoint's default voicemail password. If you miss a call or multiple calls, they will show up on your display and when you return to your phone, simply press the View Soft button or the Exit button. This feature can be turned off by an iTalk technician if needed. To check other voicemail boxes, press star 98 and then send. Enter the desired mailbox number and password. Then you can check voicemail and change voicemail options. Comedian mail. Mailbox. Password. You have one old message. Press one for old. To add a personal greeting and name to your extension, you can create unavailable, busy, and temporary greetings for your extension and record a name for your mailbox by simply pressing the message button, enter your password, and press zero. Then follow the prompts. Password. You have one old message. Press one, press one to record your unavailable message. Press two to record your busy message. Press three to record your name. Press four to manage your temporary greeting. Press five to change your password. Press star to return to the main menu. After the tone, say your unavailable message and then press the pound key. Hi, this is Jay. Please leave a message. Thank you. Press 1 to accept this recording. Press 2 to listen to it. Hi, this is Jay. Please leave a message. Press 1 to accept this recording. Your message has been saved. Press 1 to record your unavailable message. Press 2 to record your busy message. Press 3 to record your name. Press 4 to after the tone, say your name, and then press the pound key. J. Thank you. Press 1 to accept this recording. Press 2 to listen to it. J. Press 1 to accept this recording. Your message has been saved. Press 1 to record your unavailable message. To add an auto attendant main greeting, Press star 77 and hit send. After you hear the beep, start recording your main greeting. Press the pound key when you are finished. Listen and follow the prompts. Press pound twice when you are satisfied with your recording. The message will give you a greeting box number. For example, you will hear star 350 or star 351. Write this box number down and tell your iTalk representative what this box is used for. For example, box 350 is day greeting or box 351 is night greeting. Thank you for calling iTalk Cloud Solutions. If you know your party's extension, you can dial at any time. And again, thank you for calling iTalk Cloud Solutions. Thank you for calling iTalk Cloud Solutions. If you know your party's extension, you can dial at any time. And again, thank you for calling iTalk Cloud Solutions. You listen to press one to be recorded. Press star followed by pound. Press pound twice to save. 
star three seven five goodbye write that number down to record your next auto attendant greeting press star seven seven again and hit send do the same steps as before test message test message test greeting test greeting Star 376 is the box number. To re-record an auto attendant greeting, press star in the box number that you just recorded. For example, star 375. Then press send and follow the prompts to record new greeting. Thank you for calling iTalk Cloud Solutions. If you know your party's extension, you can dial at any time. And again, thank you for calling iTalk Cloud Solutions. To listen to it, press 1. To be recorded, press star, followed by pound. Re-record your greeting here and press pound when you are finished. To listen to it, press 1. Re-record your greeting here and press pound when you are finished. To listen to, press 1. To re-record it, press star, followed by pound. This concludes our instructional video of the Yealink T29 and 27 endpoint units. And again, thank you for choosing iTalk Cloud Solutions. It's been a pleasure serving you.